please wait for the microphone. First question for James. Sweeney in the middle. James, what was your takeaway from the hard contact that the Astros made against you the first time? And were you at all concerned about tipping because it had been a problem for you earlier in the season? Uh, not concerned about tipping. Um, I made some mistakes and also they hit some good pitches. Um, you know, so I'm going to go out there and attack and try and make the best pitches I can. Next question. Christy in the back. I know you've been asked about it quite a bit, and there's reports about you know issues with them stealing signs or, or reading p tips on pitchers. How how much do you think about that actually going into the game, or even when you are in the game? Uh, in the game, I need to focus on pitching. You know, we try to uh, mitigate that and uh, you know look at it between starts. Uh, and we didn't think they they had anything, um, and I still don't. Um, so I'm going to go out there and, and compete and. Uh, if there's anything that we think they've got in the game, we'll address that. But as of right now, I don't think they have anything. Next question. Eric, down front. James Aaron's been very aggressive with his bullpen and has told the starting pitchers that he would be aggressive. Is it difficult going out there knowing that you know, one or two bad at-bats in a row might be the end? Uh, I can't worry about that. You know, that's, that's his job. And uh, I leave that to him. When I have the ball in my hand, I'm going to do everything I can to help our team and uh, go out there and compete, and that's what I plan on doing. Dan, down the right. James, did you, did you actually look to see if you were tipping your pitches after the last start? Did, to... uh, we took a look at it, and I don't think I was giving anything away. Um, you know, so, yeah. what, do you, what do you look at when you, when you try to figure that kind of thing out? Uh, we look at to see if uh, I'm doing anything out of the full windup from one pitch to another. Uh, you know, whether I'm throwing my fastball or my curveball, if I'm doing anything different. Uh, same thing out of the stretch. Um, you know, I know they're trying to pick it up out of the glove at second base, um, and I'm uh, doing what I can to uh, to make sure they can't do that. Down in front here, Ron, on the left. With now the prospect of four days in a row, is there anything uh, – on the starting pitchers to come through with longer outings, especially with the prospect of an all bullpen game in game six? I mean, yeah, I think that uh, we want to go out there and go as deep as we can. That's always the goal. You know, we, uh, we've we had plenty of times this year where we've played four games in a row, and uh, it's the same as always. We're going to go out there and do our jobs. Back again on the right in the back, Christy. This is your first playoff experience this uh, fall. What have you taken from that? What is different from pitching in the regular season for you, and what can you use uh, tomorrow night from that? Uh, there's a higher intensity, you know, but overall it's the same game. You have to treat it the same way. It's just being able to uh, to mentally uh, treat it the same way, even though there is that extra uh, intensity and uh, and you know what we're playing for, you know. But ultimately, if you can play the game the same way you did in the regular season, you're going to have the most success. Anything else, James? Hey, James, thanks a lot. Thanks, guys.